Here are some facts regarding the Mets' decision not to sign Kumar Rocker, their top draft pick. The Mets and Rocker agreed to a $6 million signing bonus that was contingent upon the physical. Following that physical, uh, the Mets and Rocker did not negotiate another number. It's standard in the industry uh, for if there are concerns that emerge along those lines for the bonus to be lowered and for a negotiation to ensue there. It's important to note that that did not happen in this case. The Mets' decision not to sign Rocker uh, was not money related. In terms of what it was related to, we're not going to get into specific speculation about another person's health here without looking at the documents and images and irrelevant information ourselves. But the facts are uh, that's the timeline that's confirmed by sources on all sides of this issue that there was no negotiation down from the six million. So at that point, Rocker's only choice uh, would have been to sign for no signing bonus and play at a minor league salary if the Mets weren't going to uh, make a different offer to them off the six million. Rocker wasn't going to do that. So he is left now to find a different way to continue his athletic career. And the Mets now as compensation have the 11th overall pick in next year's draft. That's how it fell apart.